today is the next morning. Let's see what's happening. I wanted to wear my hair like this for New Year's, but I was like, what if it doesn't like stick, you know? So I'm gonna test it out and take it down today. I'm gonna try to be careful not to create too much fuzz. I feel like the single ones are easier to take out than the um, the actual flat twist one. So maybe I won't flat twist it next time, but. So, so far I'm thinking that I like the, I like these better. So tonight I might actually retwist this. Cause I feel like I'm getting more definition out of the ones behind. Yeah, definitely love the definition of the, the individual ones. And I was thinking about it. I don't really love middle parts on me. So I'm probably gonna retwist it like with the side part. I am not gonna tell you guys no lies. I absolutely hate it. Let me show you the back though. The back. I can work with this i cannot i'm gonna have to retwist the front tonight before i go to bed something about this is not hitting the way i need it to hit and i can't handle it okay so listen this is a new plan i'm getting lazy but i also gotta go to work i put two like regular twist dots right here and i'm just gonna twist them into little whatever them is and let them sit like that i literally cannot find my spray bottle and then my other backup spray bottle it's clogged with oil, so I'm gonna use this pattern hydrating mist to hydrate my hair. My hair feels great though, by the way. But I'm trying to figure out is is this a fail or is just that my level of three strand twist out is not advanced enough to do the flat twist and the three strand all at once? Because the last time I did a twist out, my hair was popping, but I did use melanin, so I got to figure out if it's the product or if it's me. Tomorrow I'm gonna come back and take these down and I'm gonna see if they was giving me what needs to be gave. Actually, no, I'm not gonna do that. I'll probably do that um, later. Right now I'm just gonna pull them back, throw it unfaithful. When I tell y'all having a wig is everything. This is my wig for my birthday, which was December 1st that I wore today is the 29th. That thing got some curls and it's still, still popping. So we gonna work for what we got. This is not my preferred wig thing because I feel like it's so thick, but it's what I got right now. So it's what I'm gonna work with. Pop baby girl on. This is a lovely wig, by the way. I love their wigs. I'm still learning. I'm still, you know, just part. I could have plucked it a little bit more. I could have plucked a little bit more front, but your girl is learning. I'm supposed to glue this down, but ain't nobody got time. So we just gonna give you one of these so that I am not looking crazy when I go to work. Don't I look cute this morning, y'all? I am back and the back that I put in the ponytail yesterday and the wig, like when I got home, I took it back cause I didn't really want to smush my curls. So I still have my curls there. So I'm gonna take out this front and see what it is. And I tried to part it differently. I retwisted them last night cause it wasn't tight enough. When I got home and saw how big they were, I was like, it's not gonna work. So I get the oil on my hands. TGIN is another like black owned natural hair products. And I know that the owner, she had cancer. She realizes a lot of ingredients and stuff she was putting in her body that weren't good for her. So she started her own line. I guess she got sick and her cancer came back and she is no longer with us. And I do have a few favorites from her. This Miracle Repair Anti-Breakage Serum. I absolutely love it. It feels so good and it's not as heavy as my other oils. I got lazy ups. I started three stranding on this side and then when I got to the other side I was just over it. I also feel like this is gonna be a fail but I still have not figured out if it is if it's me or if it's the product figure it out. Yeah I don't think I'm gonna like this side. I don't even know if I'm actually gonna do anything so it's okay if it's not perfect but literally yesterday I was just thinking like saw a video girl made a valid point she was like I'm not really like a fan of twist outs because she says she feels like her wash and goes come out better and I get some great definition out of my wash and goes. I will link the video of my last one and it was popping and it was all like drugstore products. Like this is more work and I don't even feel like I get, I'm getting the results that I want. But I also feel like I haven't mastered it. So once I master a twist out, it's going to be popping. But for me right now, it's just okay. And you're supposed to like let it separate where it naturally separates, I guess. Yeah, I'm probably just gonna like wash and go the front of my hair because I don't feel like I'm feeling it. The parts 
that that are not doing what we need to do i might like retwist them because i actually like how the two strand twist that i did on top i like how those came out i think more than anything let me get my pick and see what this thing do i know like last time i felt like i didn't have enough volume i felt like i looked so crazy i'm gonna go play with this and see what i can come back with and I'm gonna come back and give you guys my final thoughts. I like pinned some stuff back and shaped it a little bit. I stretched it. Well, not stretched it, I picked it out. Um, the whole reason I did the, the twist is because you get more length than you do with your wash and goes. Now I do feel like I get more definition in my wash and goes. I'm gonna post a picture of my latest wash and go. That was all Shea Moisture products that had them curls, curling, them things was thinking, okay? I'm not fully satisfied, but I think some of this was my fault with the three strand twist. I was kind of lazy, but I'm, I'm not going I'm either going to retwist or I'm going to um, just kind of like wash and go style it but it's okay I like the style I like the shape I like the length I feel like the products are okay I feel like it was more so just me because I'm happier with the back I'm happy with this side I'm happy with the front where I regular twisted at I'm just not really happy with what would happen right here when I tried to three strand and like that fat one them edges like this is what happened I'm probably gonna add some water to that so it can curl up but I'm good with these products. They smell amazing. They look amazing. They make my hair feel good. It's what my hair started with. So I think I'm always going to like them and it didn't really mess up nothing for me. Quick update. I was able to add some twists in the front and pull it together for New Year's and it came out really cute. With that said, you guys, um, if you have tried these products before, let me know how you tried them, how you use them, how it turned out. If you're not subscribed already, make sure you subscribe. Make sure you hit that notification button for more videos. And comment below if you have any feedback for me. Thank you guys so much and I will see you in my next video. Mwah.